Ford with the header. 1 0 to Motherwell. And questions being asked in the St Johnson defence. Five and a half minutes gone. And no challenge at all for Graham Ford. The orthodox corner kick from Gary McAllister. Right into the box. I just look at the space Ford's had for that powerful header into the roof there. Baron and Harrow together again. There's Blair with the header on. Here's Stewart. Grab Stewart. 2 0 to Morrowell. Five minutes of the first half left. And that certainly eases any Motherwell worries. A long kick out started the problem. John Gardner sending this long ball downfield. You'll see Baron and Harrow clash. They both miss the ball. Blair does well with the header on. It's in Johnson defence and a Fankel. Stewart in looking very sharp indeed and Baines had no chance at all. The protest of innocence from Rab Kilgour. Must confess he didn't appear to make much contact with Kagan. But the referee considers it enough to give Motherwell the free kick. Which Derek Murray will take. There's McAllister. Perfectly struck. And that seals it for Motherwell. Eleven and a half minutes left for play. How's this for finishing? Derek Murray with a free kick. It was delivered to the left by Graham Forbes. Andy Harrow controlled it, set up for McAllister. And that sweetly struck shot with the right foot makes it 3-0 to Motherwell. Arrow's header on, here's Gagan. And there's the goal. Well, not only Gagan enjoyed that, but the Motherwell fans. Oh, well, inside the last 10 minutes now. And this goal coming about in the simplest fashion. Once again, the long ball out from Gardner. It was won here by Andy Harrow, who got the vital flick on. Gagan sprinting through the defence. And a very accurate...